what's up guys I'm back uh, with a brand new video all about uh, improving your vision uh, vision treatments uh, going over like my stem cell treatment and everything I told you in the past that I was gonna keep going um, you know pursuing uh, real treatment to help optic atrophy and other eye conditions um, if you don't know um, this channel is all about my experience going to South Florida um, getting stem cell injections um, from my actual bone marrow into my eyes uh, to help improve uh, my vision and uh, so like I said it's, uh, at this point of me doing this video it's been over a year um, since I had the treatment done um, and if you've been following the channel you realize that the Florida stem cell thing didn't really do anything at all and in fact kind of a little annoyed because yeah i still i see uh floaters in my right eye and basically i wasn't seeing floaters before i had the procedure done so that was a little frustrating but some of you guys just deal with all right um but in this video i want to um, talk about do i think stem cells can actually help the vision all right so from all of my experiences believe it or not I truly believe that stem cells can help uh, improve people's vision and I, I do believe stem cells can actually help a lot of people's um, issues whether it be you know <clears throat> physical um, you know arm rehab broken legs uh, organs tissues uh, nerve damage I do believe in it but what I don't believe in right now is some of the way that these companies are handling um, the treatments and the way they're presenting them to people I don't believe that people have perfected um, the use of stem cells the way that some of these companies not all some of these companies promote their stem cells because um, lately I'm just like really deep into understanding the stem cells how they work how they should have worked and other treatments to help vision um, problems right so like I said so many different um, uses of stem cells so many different kinds of stem cells some are are described to be good for helping the vision some are described to be not so good for improving vision the problem is some of these companies are just um, saying whatever to get people to to you know spend money you know on using stem cells to help their their problem and one thing that I kind of want to touch on really in this video was the fact that I wish companies and hopefully when we get the right people together we can make this change companies really need to start becoming genuine with what they're presenting to potential patients and of course at the end of the day I know it's all about money for some of these companies I mean when you're charging just like Florida charged me twenty one thousand six hundred dollars for a procedure that basically uh, made things worse in my heart I feel like they kind of knew uh, that the chances of improvement wasn't what they presented to be and I think a lot of companies now doing more and more research a lot of companies are kind of doing that and companies need to understand that people with vision problems or hearing problems or in a wheelchair whatever people are your average person no matter age race size whatever health your average person is going to be vulnerable to you know potential treatments or cures and these companies are smart enough to feed off that you know and it's um it's kind of sad you know um because that's that's the case now do I believe that there are legit companies out there who are really trying to get to the bottom and help people with vision problems and other issues yes I honestly do it's just a matter of finding finding them getting real answers asking a lot of questions before any money is is put down for any, any sort of procedure right um, and that and that's what I'm doing in the process of doing and I and I hooked up with a guy on Facebook he reached out to me hopefully watching this video I ain't gonna say his full name I don't know if he want me to but his name is Wayne he's in the UK uh, and I'm way in the United States so the beauty of networking but uh, here's a guy who 
you know, you can tell with determined, uh, focused, and optimistic, and hopefully it'll stay that way. Um, but we're on it, man. We're, we're trying to find real answers because he has a similar condition as I do, optic atrophy, optic nerve uh, damage. Um, and just working with um, another lady we met, I'm not going to say her name because I don't know if she want me to, but very, very nice lady who I, I just spoke with on the phone. She actually had the Florida procedure done, and she also had, um, she actually went to China. And we were talking on the phone over an hour, and she was telling me how, you know, neither one of them really worked um, for helping her vision. In fact, maybe made it a little worse. And uh, that's just, that's ridiculous, you know, and, and she spent a lot of money. Um, so we're just, you know, to that point where we're just trying to find answers and to help our condition and help other vision uh, conditions. So uh, on one of my other videos, someone, I don't know who they are, obviously I just seen their name, but they, they commented to me and said, you need to try out this guy named Dr. Kundrin. I think that's how he says his name, K-O-N. D-R-O-T, I believe that's how he says his name, but he's in, I believe, California. So I was talking to Wayne about it and uh, even talking to the other lady. And this Dr. Condren apparently is is doing a stem cell treatment using, um, the, they call it cord stem cells from the cord, um, from like a baby. Not um, not the other thing that's real, I forget the name of it, but um, not the controversial whatever. But he called it using the cord stem cells. And as we speak, um, he's looking for, I guess, people to to try this on. Now, he uses, Dr. Kundra apparently uses uh, these cord cells in conjunction with, like, some type of electrical stimulation thing that he's saying that he feels like this can really help a lot of uh, vision issues. Because uh, I just watched a seminar that he did on YouTube. You can look it up. Just look up Dr. Kundry. Um, And of course, it sounds very, very promising. And it makes sense what he's saying. Um, but only thing about the whole electrical stimulation, which I'll do videos on that later. Um, that's very, very controversial uh, right now. Because I spoke with someone who had it done. And they said it was... An absolute waste anytime you do that electrical brain stimulation and then I've talked to other people who said yeah it really helped so that's another topic but um anyway so I'm in the process of trying to um, reach out to Dr. Kundrin and, and at least find people that maybe deal with him and, and try to see where he his background is and see what he can offer and if anybody uh, watching this video knows who Dr. Kundrin is you can tell him you know um, we're interested. We're looking, uh, looking into him and, and see what he has to offer, because any anybody, a doctor or whatever, who's doing these procedures, they need to be more transparent. You know, they need to be able to to talk to people and answer questions, because charging people twenty thousand dollars, fifty thousand dollars, even ten thousand, five thousand dollars, a lot of people, that, that hey, that's that's money. You know, so if you're gonna do a procedure really believe in the procedure because I believe the people in South Florida um, they're not uh, I don't know I just feel like they they very misleading um, that's my experience you know um, and they and the, the doctor down there you can't really talk to him after the procedures done he has nothing really to say and all that and I believe when people pay all this money they they want answers they want to be able to talk to the doctor doing this stuff or talk to the people that's actually doing this procedure and really get some answers. So, um, like I said, I do believe the answers are out there, you know, for, uh, you know, vision problems. Seriously, I really believe that. But we as patients or we as people suffering from this, we got to really kind of step up and, and really do our research and, and really ask questions and stay optimistic. That's what we have to do if you're suffering or know somebody suffering from any type of uh, disorder, disability, whatever. Got to stay optimistic. Um, and one thing like I want to recommend because uh, I got this book a, a while ago. It's called Pivot, P-I-V-O-T. I'll put a link. Uh, you can get it on Amazon. 
uh, it's a great book to help you stay focused and stay optimistic. It really, truly is. I talked about it on another YouTube channel um, that I have, but uh, if you're watching this and you're feeling down or you're not optimistic or not positive, check out Pivot. Now, the, the cool thing about Pivot, you can get the audio version of it. Um, and that's what I did because I read uh, Kindle books online, but I kind of switch over. If I can get it on uh, audio, I do just because it's less stress on the eyes and I'm, I'm already on a computer enough. So, you know, computer just went out. Hold on. Um, oh, there you go. Um, so, yeah, you can check that out. Uh, if, if you know somebody, like I said, uh, you can get it at Amazon. Um and just like I said, it, it, you know, that will definitely motivate you, put you in the right mind, uh, mind space, all right? But anyway, closing out this video, um, I believe there's answers out there. And if not, they're right around the corner, but we have to find them. And me uh, and the guy I'm talking with, Wayne, and, an, and another woman who had treatment done, that's what we're, we're on right now. We're finding answers. We're digging around. We're getting answers. Um, so... That's where we're at right now. And far as, like I said, going on 14 months after having the uh, stem cell injections from Florida, it wasn't wasn't good. You know, it wasn't good. But I'm going to keep on going. That's what you got to do, you know. Um, so be sure to look out for more videos. You can subscribe to this channel um, for more information and everything. Um, if you want to check out my uh, um, you caring page, because I'm still paying off this big ass bill, you can check that out. Link will also be in the description. You could donate a dollar. You could donate uh, a million if you want. Well, I don't need a million dollars, obviously. But check all that out, guys. And no matter what, though, stay tuned because we're gonna get some answers and we're gonna get improvement. All right. Till the next time. See you.